What's up? Hello. Welcome to Rob Squad Reactions. Guys, we are so excited to be back here. Just like we are every single day with amazing reaction videos suggested to us by you guys. Our amazing RSR family. But if y'all are new here, hey, what is up? It's your boy Jay. Hey y'all, it's your girl Amber. And today we have an artist that we have done before on the channel. The funny guy. Uh, but however, that's the thing. You guys mm. said that the songs we have done by him, Mr. Jim Croce, uh, Bad, Bad, Leroy Brown. And you don't mess with Jim. Yeah, they were more along his hum humorous side. You guys said he's a great writer, singer, songwriter, but we need to check out some of his stuff that's a little more in-depth. So we're checking out a song called Time in a Bottle. Excited to get into this one. But if you are new here, hey, we don't drop videos once or twice, but... Three times, y'all. Every single day. So if you like this video, hit that post notification bell and subscribe to the channel. You'll never miss anything that we got going. And we got to give the people what they want. That's, a, that, that's the channel... Slogan, let's check him out, Jim. Because we always mispronounce his I name. I know, it's always. And you guys tell us every last time I time. thought I had it right, and then Croce, you guys got Croce. me in the comments. Croce, that's right, right? Yeah, Croce. That's, right. that's how I. That's what I figured out this time. We're gonna get it right. Time in a bottle from '73. Let's check it out. '70s baby. If I could save time in a bottle The first thing that I'd like to do Is to save every day Till eternity passes away Just to spend them with you If I could make days last forever if words could make wishes come true I'd save every day like a treasure And then again I would spend them with you But there never seems to be enough time To do the things you want to do once you find them Jim Croce has a, a really sweet voice, and, I, and I'm glad we're finally getting to hear something, you know, something that's not kind of comedy from him. But his voice and the way that he plays and the way he plucks that guitar and the way the strings sound, I really like this so far. I really like this side of him. It, it's yeah. very gentle, calm, kind of kind of smooth. I love it. It's uh, like you guys said, the songs that we had done by him before they were humorous, they were catchy. This one's much more, I don't know, empathetic and and personal. I mean, he's talking about loving someone so much that if he could just bottle up that time that he spent and put it in a bottle and keep it. And that's so relatable as parents, as, you know, anyone in the world, you know, right. just loving someone or just wanting to have that, that, that time. time. So I think, time. yeah, so I think that the lyrics, like we knew he was a great songwriter by his other songs. But I love the lyrics in this one as well because they are so soft and sweet and gentle. And outside of his, the lyrics and his voice, I just love the way the guitar is played. The guitar, for sure. I've looked around enough to know that you're the one I want to go through time with. a box just for wishes and dreams that had never come true the box would be empty except for the memory of how they were answered by you but there never seems to be enough time to do the things you want to do once you find them Looked around enough to know you're the one I want to go through time Those high notes on the strings. That was so good. The 
guitar work in this though is by far my absolute favorite. The way that he the way that he was plucking this and you you could hear each individual string mm -hmm. so clear and then a little section right there at the end he was on that very very bottom this D string just plucking away at it. Oh, it gives yeah. you that such high pitch. See, I tone. almost didn't know what instrument it would be cuz it was mm -hmm. played in such a cool tone. I was like, "Oh, I love the way that's that's added in." But I thought that that was fantastic. I loved, loved, loved getting to listen to the lyrics. Like when he said that there's nobody else that he'd rather go and spend all of his time with. And when you find something that you want to do in life and you don't have the time left to do it. Like, I feel like we can all relate to that. Yeah, all, everybody. You know what I mean? Everybody. There's all something that we wish we could be doing that would make our soul happy. And sometimes it just feels like there's not enough time in the world for it. So I really liked this song. I loved the sentiment. I loved his songwriting, but the guitar was fantastic. The guitar was absolutely fantastic. And again, that was only our third time doing uh, Jim. Oh, Jim Croce. Croce. I, I literally have to stop and think about it before I say it. So we definitely need to get more uh, down into that rabbit hole in this catalog. So well, keep suggesting more songs. And I know that his catalog is pretty deep. It is, so, it's deep from what y'all said. Right. So on our uh, first two reactions of Jim, you guys were saying, oh my gosh, I can't believe you guys you know, have just found him. Wait till you just dive more and more into it. And then when we did another one that was more catchy and humorous, like, okay, just wait. If you guys think this is all Jim is, just wait until you hear some and that, of his... And that's all I thought he was. was yeah. a, it was like a, a comedic songwriter. Yeah, singer. well, I mean, they were great. They were great. But um, just adding the... He's a folk singer, obviously. But getting to see what he can do just within, like, the the folk way in which he writes and composes his music is really cool. We get Bad Bad Leroy Brown and then we get Time in a Bottle yep. from the same man. No so that's it. just a testament to how great he is and a testament to how excited I am to continue to learn more about Jim Croce because you guys said there's a lot to go and see where else we go with him here. So continue dropping those suggestions down in the comments. Like you said, we definitely, we need to learn more about him. We, we, we need to hear more well, from him. And then if you think about it, this song was literally just guitar and his voice. That's it. The, I mean, that, that and I, really if you think it. about the other songs, I think so honestly simple. it was heavily carried on mm -hmm. guitar, acoustic guitar, and his voice. That's another testament to the man's songwriting and the fact that he could carry songs with no nothing but to his beautiful it. voice and the guitar. But guys, thank y'all so much for the suggestion as we send y'all out of here every single day. We love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed no matter what the circumstances are. And for you new family members that hit that subscribe button down below, hey, we welcome you guys and hope you enjoy your time here with us. But before you go, you have got a goal just like we do. And the rest of our RSR family, tell them that goal. All right, guys, this is a goal we've had from the very beginning of the very channel. Beginning. And we hope that it's doing some good in the world, just like you guys it's are. It's our goal on all of our channels, For too. For sure. Um, we hope that you guys go out and make somebody smile. We love you guys. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.